She lived in this horrible crate for six years. She had another dog living alongside of her in separate crates, but they never had a chance to interact. The smell was horrid, but it didn't matter to me because these guys needed help. You would have expected them to act in a negative way, but they just gave kisses. It's honest to God, like they were so thankful to have love that they never had before. Angel and Spud. She's a goodness, baby. Spud. Hey. We were able to get Spud adopted in a matter of a few weeks because he was in better shape. When Angelica first came to us, I really didn't know what to expect. Angelica was a little bit more of a challenge because she had been in her crate for such a long time that we had to build up strength in her back legs. I was so blown away by her instant trust. And then of course, she and I had to hit the town. You've never been in a car before. Is this exciting? You don't really know what to think. Angelica was kept in a crate for six years. So you know what we're doing? What are we doing, girl? We're getting a hamburger. Oh, hell yeah. It's time for a hamburger. Hi, can I get two cheeseburgers, please? Anything else, man? Uh, Angelica, do you want anything else? No, that's good. Hang on. <laughs> All right. I'm very proud to be the one to give her her very first cheeseburger. Hey, girl. Okay, how about a bite? Chew, chew, chew. <laughs> oh, welcome to your new life. She reminded me of Dorothy going to the Wizard of Oz where everything is in color. The whole world was new to her. She got a rope toy and it was like Christmas morning. She got to sleep in a nice, soft, warm place. We took her to the dog park to play and she just kept going up to these people. We felt like she's trying to tell us something. They approached me and they didn't even know her story and they fell in love with her. Hi, big girl. Today is an exciting day for you. When she was adopted, we just all knew that this is where she's meant to go. Get him, Angelica, your little brother. Spud and Angel were flourishing. So we thought we gotta get them together and let them see how far they've come. It would be the first time they connected in three months. That reunion was better than anyone thought it would be. It made me realize that through all the tears and the stress and the anger, it's all worth it. It's worth every single one that we save. Angelica was ready to just embrace the life in front of her and not hold on to bitterness or anger. There's a lesson in there. We can all find the good in every situation and look forward and say, here I am, I'm ready for the next chapter.